Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Andrew Lewis, and today my topic is gun control. Gun control has been debated in Congress for years. People have been arguing over whether or not gun legislature should be passed to prevent the sale of guns to normal civilians. And news media increasingly over this past year has covered the violence of, gun of guns and has shown us like the horrors that we cannot ignore right now. People have been dying in parties, at pubs, in conference centers, even just walking down the streets. We cannot ignore this any longer. These are people we need to care about. I have three solutions, which I will talk about to you now, of how we can prevent gun violence in our country. The first, for one, it is too easy to buy guns. According to Gregory Orphalia, a mass shooter bought his semi-automatic weapon more easily than buying vitamin D. A semi-automatic -automa weapon is a gun which you can pull the trigger and as fast as you pull that trigger, a bullet will fire. This mass shooter bought his gun more easily than buying over-the-counter medicine. This is something that we need to stop. For one way it is too easy to buy guns is people buy guns online. According to Gregory, Gregory Orphalia, selling weapons online and through mail carriers should be banned entirely. Someone like a psychopath can easily buy his gun just simply because nobody knows who he is when he's online. Say he goes to eBay and he bids on a gun and, bu and buys it. That seller, the seller who um, is selling the gun, has no way of knowing who they're selling it to. This is, should not be allowed. Um, these bans would require action, legal action. People would have to get together. We would have to get together and vote. Um, better gun control laws would lead to lives saved. According to a source, 56% of mass shooters clearly had known mental illness and at lower percentages had domestic violence history or were involved in an intense divorce custody battle. These results point out critical elements of stability to be assessed during background procedures. Linux 2014. According to that source, 56% of shooters, mass shooters could have been stopped if we would have been able to enforce thorough background checks. Um, more background checks and less um, automatic weapons would lead to lives saved. For automatic weapons are weapons where you can just simply hold down the trigger and it will fire off bullets multiple times per second. So, that, for one thing, there's no reason for that. Why would we need a gun that can shoot like 20 bullets a second? Like, no hunter, no civilian, nobody needs a gun that can shoot that many bullets at once. Even if you were trying to stop a bad guy, you wouldn't need to shoot him 20 times. One bullet would do the, tr do the trick. It is getting harder and harder to ignore the deaths from gun violence. Um, according to Lewis 2018, media polls reveal half of the U.S. is for gun control policy, and this number will only increase as people cannot ignore the horrors guns inflict. Why wait? Why would we wait to do something about gun control? We can do it right now. According to CNN, CNN, we are 28 weeks into, no, 23 weeks into 2018, and already we have 23 shooting, school shootings alone. Um, according to their analysis, they included guns that f were fired and then accidentally shot someone, as well as guns that were fired with real intent and a person is injured. That's one school shooting per week. This is something that cannot be ignored. These are our children, people. These are like our children. Um, we need to do something. In conclusion, buying a gun should not be like buying shoes at a shoe store. We need gun policies that will ban the sale of automatic weapons entirely, ban the sale of guns online, and we need to enforce background checks. We cannot wait any longer. For those of you who have just listened to my speech, I encourage you to go out to your friends and family and talk about this. Discuss how they feel, and then we need to get together and vote. The next time voting season comes around, this has to be on the docket. Thanks for listening to my speech.